most of them is their first time to believe. So they were anxious to see and they were asking questions. And while we were there, asking questions in the plane as to uh, uh, what are the good destinations, what they expect in Belize. But I believe it's a wonderful experience for, for them. It's a milestone for Belize again. That, uh, that again will help us to increase our numbers. Who better than the Jewels Tourism Minister to introduce 131 new passengers to the lights of Belize? It was a role Manuel Heredia Jr. took on with pride as he was first off the steps of the Red and Blue Iron Bird of Southwest Airlines, which had just landed from Denver, Colorado, USA. In the 17 months since Southwest began operations between Belize and Houston, Texas, it has earned rave reviews for lower prices and upgraded service to its competitors. And the challenge, according to local manager Linda Neal, is to maintain that position. I lead a team here in Belize who keeps our flights on time and treat you with warm Southwest hospitality. We are proud to offer Denver as our newest destination in the United States for Belize travelers. You all are making history today with Southwest Airlines. This flight will be not only Southwest's first international trip to Belize city from Denver, but Southwest is the only carrier at Denver International Airport to offer this route. We are excited that in addition to this Denver flight today, we are offering daily service to Belize from our new international gateway in Fort Lauderdale beginning in June. With this, we will offer service to the West, the Heartland, and the Eastern U.S. this summer. All in America's original low fare and most loved airline. Unusually, earlier there was already a Southwest jet on the ground, leaving Belize with passengers an hour and a half before the flight in from Denver touched down at the PGIA. But it hardly mattered to the smiling visitors greeted by three youthful dancers in Belize garb and a bag of goodies to mark the occasion. Chief Tourism Officer Abel Castaneda says the new flight brings the Rocky Mountain and Western region of USA closer to Belize. Today does solidify um, what we would like to describe and what we believe to be a very viable and a very mutual alliance and partnership that we have with our partners of West Airlines. I think um, I can say on behalf of the minister that it is a great honor, it is a great privilege that together we are continuing to make Belize our little jewel, our little paradise, um, a little bit more accessible to our visitors, to our guests, from, in this case, from the Southwest United States, and of course the larger American market, North American market, but also for our very own Belizeans who um, are also avid travelers, for them to have another convenient connection um, between Belize and the U.S. According to the U.S. Embassy, Belize U.S. tourism remains a key foreign exchange earner and the Southwest expansion to Denver unites the area that have a lot more in common than you may think. Particularly in lean times, Belize's tourism industry is likely to become even more critical. And Belize's tourism industry relies on its American customers. Belize and Denver have a lot in common. Both are known as eco-friendly tourist havens with mountains, forests, waterfalls, eco-friendly hotels, and skiing. Although in Belize, it's skiing of the water kind. Colorado is one of the leaders in renewable energy, an industry of particular interest in Belize. So this is a very natural partnership. For the minister, Southwest's value is in action, reducing rates and improving customer service with aggressive competition. It is all about expanding both the airlines and country's brand. Southwest has been a very good partner with the civil aviation and the government of Belize. I see them as a very aggressive airline that uh, they don't talk too much. It's action. When it comes to uh, people living in, in, the, in Denver and elsewhere in the surroundings over there, it is important because those are new visitors to Belize new people that will make a difference in arrival and so forth. And I believe that uh, that is what we need. We are searching with the semi-existing -air airlines, other destinations, and we are looking also at alternative in, in the, the in airlines also. Reporting for News 5, I'm Andrea Polanco.